Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Trophynet and welcome back to The Witcher 3 on the That March difficulty. Today we're gonna continue helping Yennefer out with her preparations for uh, lifting the curse. And the first thing we need to do is use this Potesta Quisitor to uh, actually find a source of, uh, well, power that uh, is disturbing her uh, megascope. So let's walk around with this thing. Uh, I don't know if I can actually run with this thing. Yeah, I can. So the game actually already points us down to the uh, general direction of what we need. You can already hear it chirping louder. Oh, got a signal. Signal's growing stronger. So over there we have Vasimir and the ugliest man alive. Because if you didn't already know, Uma is actually short for ugliest man alive, a short from uh, apart from the fact that he says Uma all the time. It seems to be coming from over here. Uh -huh. Getting warmer, warmer, hot. Can we talk? Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna. It's actually really funny. I'm gonna let it play here. I'm looking for Siri. Ashen hair, scar on her cheek. Seen her? I think that's a yes. So uh, we could go on all day like this, but... Uh, it's clearly not coming from him as we thought. So long. But... This thing uh, is going haywire. Warmer. Warmer. Hot. And in are. here, disturbance is coming from there. Strange boxes. Maybe Vesemir can tell us more. What's in these crates? Dimeridium bombs. Lambert made them. No, and that explains everything. Work. All right, gotta get him out of here. I can do that. Rather you not make a mess of my shelves. Just keep an eye on Uma. Yes, Uncle Vesemir. <laughs> How goes it? Vesemir's not working you too hard, I hope. <laughs> Thought so. So this is actually an even funnier conversation. All done. You can go. Now, let's check your conditioned reflexes. Okay, there we go. Uh, I'm not really sure if we can talk some more to Vesemir, yes. but... What is it, Wolf? I met with Amir. I met with Amir. Any crowned heads you haven't met? A few. Hoping it stays that way. Remember the first war with Nilfgaard? Battle of Sodden? The North, all of it, fought together. Tamaria, Redania, Cadwin, Eden. And the mages were heroes, on the field first, then in balance. Not much left of that world. No, it's not, so, uh, too bad. Yeah, the Battle of Sodden is something that's clearly described in the books, where a lot of sorcerers and sorceresses uh, lost their lives, See because they fought again. along the humans. Well, the rest of the north. But hey. That's all history right now. So let's get back to Yennefer and tell her that we found uh, a little dimeridium, which was uh, toying with her megascope, which caused the crystals to explode all the time. Hopefully she's happy with that so she can uh, contact Ida, I think was her name, the elven sage she, she wants to contact. So let's talk to her. Thank you. Seems to be working now. What was it? Dimeridium bombs. Lambert left them by the beds. Hmm. I suppose he had no idea they could interfere with my megascope? Lambert doesn't know shit about megascopes. Yeah, that's you probably know, right. Lambert's not exactly an expert on megascopes, so... Please. Lambert is mean, not stupid. Enough. Ready for this conversation? Sure you want me here? Members of the Lodge don't let just anyone in on their secrets, or so I've heard. 
Consider it a token of our trust. Now let's begin. And Geralt, behave, please. As always. So you trust me. Stop twisting my words. Cadmel Yennefer at Vengerberg. Gwynglade. Hello, Ida. Cadmel and Severn. Why have you summoned me? We've come up against a curse. One we must lift. It was uttered in a dialect of elder speech unfamiliar to me. I see. The words of the curse? Vafel Elen, Kedmil Foli, Gledevdon Eptenid, Bondro Isne. Oh, she's terrified all of a sudden. Recognize the dialect? Lathan Umdod. Meaning? The so called One Speech, a forgotten language dating from before the migration. The migration? Later, Geralt. Take it you've heard the words before. Yes, in legends, of the kind that do not end happily. Can you help us with the curse? To a degree, Agnes de Glanville's incantation, combined with Elder's Triangle, inverted, of course. They are your only possible recourse, but I cannot guarantee that even they will suffice. Thank you, Ensevern. Vafel. That does not conclude our conversation. Why does she look so creepy and we do not from her side? Um, guessing you want something in return. Uh, hmm. What's the problem? What is it? The time of the white frost and white light is nigh. And the world will perish amidst ice. I know Ithleen's prophecy. I don't doubt you know it. But do you understand it? The Elder Blood can initiate the final age, the time of the end. Or stop it. Remember this, Gwynblade, for you will be the one to determine if the seed bursts into flames. And that is actually pretty close to the truth. Because our decisions in the, the coming quests will actually determine what ending we will receive. The migration, what was that about? What was that about? The migration? Good gods. Did they teach you no history here? No. Vesemir figured sword work could be more useful on the path. Gonna answer me? Naturally. One's never too old to learn. The Ense and the NN elves were once one folk, the N Undod. Then came a cataclysm. No one knows its nature. The N Undod were forced to leave their world. They split along the way. So if Uma's curse was uttered in this lathe and Undod... Then it's old. Very, very old. As in Wild Hunt old? Um, you understand that? Any idea what she was talking about? Siri, of course. Wish everyone would just leave her the hell alone. Wouldn't count on it. Sadly, no, of course. She's too important for that, but what now? All in all, interesting conversation. What now? Finish whatever it was you and the boys were planning to do. Then we'll begin. Okay, she slid across the floor and we got a nice chunk of experience for that. I think we might actually level up soon. So, let's talk to Lambert about journeying to the Circle of Elements and uh, help him power up the uh, phylactery is our next objective so which is very handy because Lambert is actually really close by looks like everything got a bit of a bit gray because of our conversation it's a lot less saturated than it was before which is weird I'm guessing it's because of that conversation we just had with a megascope hello Lambert what's this Brewing potions? No. Booze from potato peels. Are you still mad at me for our from quests? Welcome back feast? Actually, more like my farewell feast. Haven't heard? Madame Sorceress has requested I fortify the phylactery with power from the Circle of Elements. Says it's essential to lifting the curse from that monstrosity of yours. Okay, she might be Siri, dude. Realize that monstrosity, as you put it, might be Siri. Yeah, I heard. Mind and he doesn't care. I call him like I see him. That's how I am. Fair enough. Know what? Never mind. 
Not gonna argue with you. Right, no time to lose. The monstrosity awaits. Oh, you really oh, wanna have a sorry. The punch in the face. Cirilla. So, don't sound too thrilled about this. Don't sound too thrilled about all this. I'm not. You know the trek to the circle's no walk in the park. In more ways than one. Let me go with you. Well, might have more spring in my step with the famous white wolf at my side. So, you ready? Of course I am. Let's go, Lambert. Caught one thing to do. No, let's go. No reason to wait. Let's go. Oh, meant to tell you. Can't get to the circle through the mountains. Rocks go, Lambert. Rocks the pass last spring. So we approach from the pond side. Like when we did the trial of the medallion? Exactly. Remember the way? Not easily forgotten, that. He who returns with his medallion will prove himself worthy and may set off on the path. Vesemir ever hear you impersonate him? <laughs> yeah. Old man. Sabola's breach. Still haven't patched it up? Vesemir'd like to. It doesn't bother me, though. I'm not expecting anyone to lay siege, and... This way I got a shortcut to the pond. Shame those salamander assassins didn't punch a few more holes in our walls. Or finish the job and reduce these ruins to rubble. So that's uh, a hint towards The Witcher 1, the first game, in which uh, Kaer Morhen is attacked and attacked in the very first act of the game. Swim across the pond? No, I got a boat moored there. You know, for fishing. Wow, never took you for the fishing type. I use bombs. I drop them in and scoop up whatever floats to the surface. <laughs> <laughs> that makes sense. Well, it's efficient in a way. Time efficient, anyway. Anything else you want to talk about, Lambert? Because you seem to have lost your tongue. Oh, harpies. Harpies, harpies everywhere. But hey, let's continue following Lambert if he would get a move on. Tell me about Vesemir. Things any better between you? Seems so. Old man's dropped the moralizing, and I try not to piss him off too often. Mm -hmm. Working out well? Moderately. Castle's pretty big. Easy to stay out of each other's way. And then we arrive at a hut. Damn it. Moored it right here, I swear. Line must have come loose. Really? Here I thought the boat untied itself to go for a jaunt on its own. Damn it. In this fog, we'll never... There a storm before I arrived? Let me think. Yeah, five days passed. Mm. Wind must have grabbed the sail, tugged the boat off its mooring. Boat drifted into the bushes. Hmm. Might have been destroyed as well then, but... Let's go check it out. I'm gonna move it a little bit because Lambert is a bit too slow for my tastes. So... Should probably take the water side. And take out these drowners. And there go all the drowners. Last thing we need. And another water hack. So let's finish that. Bitch off. It's a bilge hack, by the way, but I don't care. I really, really don't care. The boat is cave probably over there. Is just opposite. See it? Got to sail across the pond, go through the cave, climb Troll's head, and we're there. Of course, that's easy. Doesn't seem like such an ordeal now, does it? No. Still gives me the shivers, though. You know, only two boys returned from my group. You were the ones who ran into Old Spear Tip in the caverns, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, that still bother you? That's still gnawing at you. Gnawing? 
No. Straight old pisses me off. What the fuck was that trial for? Most who returned from the Circle of Elements died within a year in some swamp, hunting drowners for Crown 30 ahead. So exactly what was the point? Ought to ask Vesemir. Oh, I have. Many times. Believe you me. Okay. Um, well, seems like a bit of a trauma for Lambert, so uh, let's jump in the boat. Let's go. Jump in the boat. All right. I'm taking the tiller, though. Because? Because it's my boat, not up for discussion. Fair enough. I'm going to quickly see if I can't find any ingredients here. Especially from the water hack. There we go. Let's jump in. God damn it. Swamp. Swamp. Can't move. Oh god. God, god damn it. Just get in. Get in. What are you... What are you doing? Okay, now don't, don't stand on the... Inside of the boat, thank you. Now slowly walk over here and sit the fuck down. Thank you, Geralt. Okay, let's go. Make this boat yourself? Yeah. Something you don't like about it? Besides the water up to our ankles? Nothing. Quit whining. It'll make it across the lake. Provided we don't smash into something first. Barely see the tip of my nose. It's not that foggy. And there seems to be a drowner right below us. But I can't see it. Over there. Fog's thick as curdled milk. Never took you for a poet. Oh, but I am one. Wanna hear a limerick? Sure. Lambert, Lambert, what a prick. Not bad. Fall off a bit. Sails fluttering. Don't teach your grandma to suck eggs. Right, almost there. Okay then. So this quest is called the final trial and we'll uh, soon find out why. We already know that Lambert had to go through this cave when he got his initiation as a witcher. Ready for the caverns? And that most of his uh, we go inside. companions oh, died. Drink a dose of cat, I know. Any more words of wisdom? Like, step softly or you'll wake old Speartip? Is he still around? Old Speartip still down there? Yeah, he is. Unless he's done us a favor and killed over on his own. Could come at us at any moment. How'd the rhyme go? Old Speartip's a deep sleeper. Wake him up and you'll sleep deeper. Come on. Ah! Hear that? Sounds like a kid. You know this valley's uninhabited except for us. It's gotta be an illusion. What if it's not? Ah! Ah! It does sound a bit ghastly. Whatever you want to do. Yeah, we should investigate just in case, just because I want to show you everything, of course. We'll investigate, just in case. You know, Vesemir's right. You do poke the damn hive, almost always. Fine. Let's go. Let's go uh, check where the boy's voice is coming from. It's apparently coming from up there. Boy, look! Hey, boy! Hey, little guy. It's all right, you're safe now. No! No! Help! And there we go. Fine. Consider yourself vindicated. You were right. Well, well, what do you know? We can talk about that later. Got the foglets to take care of now. Okay, that was a bit tougher than expected. Who would have thunk? You're not gonna let this drop anytime soon, are you? No, I will not. In fact, 
Whole world should hear about the time the famed Geralt of Rivia was duped like a child. Think we ought to get Dandelion to write a ballad about it. How's that sound? Sounds amazing. Better save than sorry. Should, should sing about you instead. Dandelion should sing about you instead. Lambert, the smartass witcher. Better that than naive. Smartasses live longer. Well, we're still Changing alive, subjects. aren't we? Did I see right? Was that boy? Yeah, one of ours. Must have drowned during his trial. Foglets remembered his voice and appearance. Charming. Let's get out of here. Needn't ask me twice. In fact, I didn't even want to come here. Lambert, enough. Yeah, we're sorry, but I wanted to show the viewers this. Uh, I'm gonna pick up the Foglet loot. There we go. And let's head back to the cave. And actually enter it this time. There we go. Don't really need caps. Maybe I should. There we go. It's better for you guys as well that you can see what's going on here. Amethyst dust. It's actually pretty nice. So go through the cave. Can we climb up here? No, I don't want to skip. I just wanted to climb. Shit, too damn high. Not if I give you a boost. Remember? Part of the trials. A witcher is a lone hunter. But even a lone hunter can use a helping hand sometimes. Vesemir. Ready? Three, two, one. Me a fat fuck. You fat fuck. And uh, one, is Carol going to help you up? Two. Three. Okay, that was no easy. Feather either. Come on, let's go. Well, you're both wearing uh, pretty heavy armor, so. Hmm. Wall looks a little shaky. Ard, maybe? Mm. Wh which wall? Am I not stunting like that? Relax, I slipped. What? Did I? Oh, I just. Yeah, okay, never mind. I just climbed over that. I don't know what the big issue was there. Let's blast our way through everything. Bones, bones. Oh, something fell in my eyes. Splinter, I think. Hope it wasn't from a broken mirror. That would make you even nastier. Ha ha. <laughs> so the marker is looping us around. Don't know if it's actually correct, but... Because we could have just gone through over there. But hey, I'm whining. There we go. And let's head through the cave. Mold. What did you expect? Ah, Sent a virus. So soft and sweet. Just oh, sleep in there. There he is. You want to make this moment last forever. So let's use Quen and save as well because this might be a problem. So we should go up there. Not really sure whether we can avoid this fight. Oh, come on, get up. Thank you. And we're through without fighting the giant. Oh, good to be back above ground. Mm hmm. Still trouble ahead. You mean the trolls? They're in for trouble, not us. Hmm. I'd rather be careful. <laughs> we ought to be careful. This is their turf. Couple of trolls got you soiling your knickers? Was bold and brash once, like you. Then I took a pitchfork in the gut. Peasant kid, not a troll. I almost died. Hard way to learn, but I did. Come on. Okay, I'm gonna drink a white honey because this is looking ridiculous. There we go. Vision back to normal. And let's see what we can do about these trolls. 
See him shit and run as soon as he saw us? Never known a troll to do that. Witches is to walk no more. The stops? This mountain. Trolley mountain. Trolley mountain. mountain. Huh? Oh. Oh. Hi! This troll mountain. Uh, you talk to these idiots. Fine. Uh, just want to get to the circle. Stay just calm. passing by. We just want to get to the circle. Which is this thing one say, thing two do, thing three do, sometime. <laughs> uh, enough! Out of my way, dimwits, or I'll grind you to gravel. Understand? Oh! Mm hmm, they understood all right. Congrats. Run for the cave before they stone us to death. Uh, yeah, what, what direction is that? Okay, over there. Because you can actually fight these right now. Don't know what I just did. I wanted to use art. There we go, and I'm lost. There we go. So let's head up behind them. And have another chat. Because we can resolve this peacefully. We walk those. Those goes no far more. Which is this understanding? We understand it, but we still gotta get to the circle of elements. We definitely yes, understand it. We trolls come no to witches castle. Rock Slotler. Pretty rock. Enjoying this little chat? Cause uh, it's not getting us anywhere. Um, let me talk, alright? I'm talking. Fact is, you know as much about negotiating as they do about grammar. We're not here to hurt you. We don't want to touch your rocks. Just let us pass. Troll rock troll. Witches strike no back. Just talky talky. Yep, Witcher. talky talky. Good? Yep, oh, which are good. You. Which is his monster kills trolls monsters. Yes, true is. No face make. <laughs> no face make. Oh, come on, give me a second. Um, we do go this. Use sharp back clubs leave here. Use pass. No grease. We smash. So, uh, if we leave our swords, we can pass peacefully, and that's actually the truth coming from these trolls. So, uh, we're gonna leave our soul swords here, charge up the phylactery, and get back. Alright, we'll leave our swords here. Pick them up on the way back. We want to know. You nuts! Shut up and follow my lead. Because he's kind of right, we're kind of nuts doing this, but uh, we can't actually trust these guys. So let's go to the circle of elements. Mr. Colin, hmm? if I remember Pappy Vesemir's lessons correctly, witchers kill monsters. Your memory's shit. They only kill harmful monsters. They threw stones at us, Geralt. Whine about it to Esco later. Just a few steps. In Are you tired? I mean. We've been a lot higher than that. And suddenly it's night. Well, we made it. No denying that. Damn. Beautiful view. <laughs> High praise coming from you. Must be if you noticed it. Geralt, who do you take me for? Let me think. A sourpuss? <laughs> Fair enough. But save the rest of your compliments for later. Let's get to work. Remember how this circle works? Been a while since I activated my medallion here. It's fine, old man. No need to make excuses. Light the torches and place the phylactery on the altar. I'll handle the rest. Okay, I can do that. Put the phylactery on the altar. How'd it go? Done. Water, then earth, 
thin air? Uh, light. Light. Whew. I'm gonna take that. Hit the ignite. Yeah. And ignite. There we go. So, uh, go ahead, Lambert. All right. Phylactery's in place. Then all we gotta do is wait. The container will absorb the power of the elements. Oh, yes, look. It's doing it. Well, it's doing something, at least. And we'll enjoy the view in the meantime. So, how'd you deal with the trolls when you passed the trial of the medallion? Let me think. Oh, yeah. Used Axie. But I only had to get past one troll. Other two were busy. Yeah, useful sign, Axie. Saved my life a short while ago. Hmm. Axie saved your life? Sense a good story coming. One of the best. A couple of road robbers stopped me. One pointed a crossbow at me. And the other started rummaging through my satchel. And made the man with the crossbow shoot his friend. And then hang himself. Sounds a uh, <laughs> great story. Wow. Truly great story. Isn't it? Real side splitter, I think. Tell me, you always been such a cynical bastard? No. I was adorable before Vesemir brought me to Kaer Morhen. That sounds really bitter. We all went through it. That's just it. Not everyone made it. Lots of boys died here. Boys taken against their will. It was our destiny. Destiny? Let me tell you about destiny. My dad was a drunk. He'd knock a few back, then beat me and mom bloody. We prayed for his death every night. One day our prayers were almost answered. Dad lost his way coming home from the tavern, walked smack into a nest of Neckers. But some witcher saved him. Know what he wanted in return? The law of surprise. Or just you, probably. Give me the first thing you see yeah, when you okay. get home. My life. For the life of that prick? I say fuck that kind of destiny. Sorry, Lambert. Didn't know that no. story. I'm sorry. Next time you wonder why I'm so bitter. Well, there's your answer. All right. And thanks for sharing We've anyway. Enough. Let's get out of here. A charged phylactery. And I've got... Need let's to get, get our swords, swords back. Which are with no swords like a man without an arm. Sure thing, brother. Which is his sharp back club takes and home goes. Yes, we will. Don't worry. I don't need convincing. Come on, girl. Let's Why are you talking like he's deaf? Don't think they're deaf. <laughs> and now his head hurts. Poor troll. Right. Back to the fortress. Right. Let's get back. After you, sir. Uh, so that's it for uh, the second quest to bait a foretail is the next one. Uh, but we completed the final trial. I'm gonna take a little break and we'll continue this uh, next time. So thank you guys enormously for watching. If you enjoyed the episode, don't forget to like it right here on YouTube. And if you haven't already, don't forget to give it a thought to subscribe to my channel because any support really really helps in making all these episodes thank you guys again enormously for watching and i hope to see you in the next video stream goodbye